Anyways, then let's get into the Java file for our main activity. And we will start by defining the variables. So just above the on create method, let's start with the edit text. So I'll just write private edit text, then space, then the name of the edit text variables. So I'll just name them in a way so that you can understand what these edit text variables are for. So I'll just write edit text login email, comma edit text login password. Then below that I'll define one progress bar. Alright. Then getting inside the on create method, first of all I'll set the title for the activity. So for that just write get support action bar dot set title. Then within brackets within double quote write login. So this will set the text login in the action bar of this activity. All right. Then edit text login email equals find view by ID because first of all, we have to link the view of the edit text, which was defined for email with this variable so that we can obtain the email, which was entered by the user. Then under bracket, just write r dot id dot edit text underscore login underscore email. If you have defined any other id for the edit text that we had defined for taking the login email of the user in the layout file, then you can kindly use the same id here as well because both of these ids have to match. In the same way, I'll find the id of the login password edit text. All right, then finally we can find the view of the progress bar also. Then I'll just call one method show height password. It's not defined yet, so I'll just define it now. You can click on this create method show height password in main activity. All right, this method will be used to show and hide the password using the eye icon. So let's begin by defining one image view variable. Let's say image view show hide password. And then I'll just bound the view of the eye icon that we had defined in the layout with this variable. All right. Then using this variable, I'll set the image source of the image view in the layout file. So just write image view show height password dot set image resource. Then within brackets r dot drawable dot ic show password. Now this will set the image resource for the image view element in the layout file. Then image view show height password dot set on click listener. We will define a new on click listener on this show height password image. Now coming under the on click method. First of all, we have to check whether the password is visible or not. If the password is visible, then we will hide it as well as change the eye icon. So we have to check whether the password is visible or not. So for that, just write if then within bracket edit text login password, which is the variable for the edit text, which is going to hold the actual password being entered by the user, then dot get transformation method then dot equals then within bracket hide returns transformation method dot get instance so basically we are just checking whether our password is visible or not if our password is visible then we will make it hidden so for that i'll just write edit text login password dot set transformation method then within bracket password transformation method 
dot get instance all right so this will make our password hidden then after that we have to change the i icon also now to change the i icon just write image view show hide password then dot set image resource then within bracket r dot drawable dot ic show password then in the else part we have to hide the password so it means if the password is visible then the if part will be executed if the password is hidden then the else part is going to execute it if the else part is being executed that means we have to show the password and then change the i icon accordingly so i'll just write edit text login password dot set transformation method then within the bracket hide returns transformation method dot get instance then in the next line image view show hide password dot set image resource then within bracket r dot drawable dot ic hide password all right let's run the app now and uh, let me enter password and on clicking on the eye icon password is getting visible and the icon is also changing so that means our show height password method is working perfectly fine all right then let's register a user and to register the user we have to open the register activity since we are still working in the main activity we cannot register the user from here so i'm going to declare and define one text view which will act as a link to open the register activity so let me just define one text view so let's say text view register equals find view by id r dot id dot text view underscore link underscore register then text view register dot set on click listener we are going to set a on click listener on this text view so that when the user taps on this text view the register activity can be opened up now inside the on click method i'm going to start a new intent so let's give a name to this intent as register activity equals new intent then within bracket main activity dot this comma register activity dot class and it's going to show error because we have not created any register activity till now but don't worry about that we are going to create the register activity right after this then getting on the second line just start the activity so within the bracket register activity since that is the name of the intent all right 